1,000 likes to prove your existence. Let me start this list with a simple clip, a video that shows the heart of a beautiful father who cares about his son, and nobody you didn't click on a therapy video. Because as this father went to his son's school to check the chairs to see if his son is sitting on a comfortable seat in a healthy environment, things went south for him and paranormal kicked in, and my bladder is kicking in too. So take a look. <laughs> Don't ask me where I found the information about this clip. I have no idea where this clip is originally from, and I can't hold myself of thinking about the rest of it. This next video is more creepy than paranormal, so don't attack me in the comments because there is no ghost in it really. But the clips are recorded by this one and only security guard, this one legend. His night shift job is to check on substations to make sure that everything is operating as it should, but there is a specific substation that he just have to make sure he doesn't go deeper in it. In other words, don't try to be a Tom Cruise. The townsfolk who lived around that building has moved away after a disaster flood, and that place was left abandoned, just like any public toilet I use. So one security guard decided for some stupid reason to discover the place, and as usual he was lost till he faced his death and was found years after. The place is so big they found photos of areas in the substation that our explorer didn't get to. And the creepiest thing about the clips is the classic music out of nowhere.
These are some of the photos I talked about in the intro, and if you want to get deeper into the story of this SCP, the link is in the description. Don't worry, it's not scary down there. If you know Ghosts of Carmel, Maine, then you know the Lamp House, and if you don't, then you're stupid, because it doesn't make any sense. So a couple of paranormal investigators from California and New York saw the documentaries about this house and they went all the way just to investigate it. And I'm here begging people to visit me when I'm sick so much that I almost got sentenced for invading other security. Anyway, they started investigating, and Kent told them to not provoke or encourage the spirits because he is trying to live there. But they did it anyways. They kept getting touched in all areas you can imagine. And if that wasn't enough, the women was kinda thirsty for more after one of those spirits tickled her leg. She was literally begging them to slap her in the face or grab her hair. She even involved her friend who is a male by the way. She wants two on one, and when she finally got what she asked for, she started complaining. She is like the wife that asks for divorce, and when you divorce her, she complains about it. I'm scared for the basement now. <laughs> oh, this is no joke. Yeah. That's full energy. That's like loud. Yeah, check that out, Kent. Ooh. You touching me? Because I know you guys got a lot to say. Can you set off the REM pod again? That's one off. Wait. Whoa. What was that? Whoa. What? What was that behind my head? I don't know. Was it the furnace or was it right behind your head? No, it's. Sounded like somebody threw a furnace that clicked. No, I, I did HVAC my whole life. That was no furnace. <laughs> yeah, the no, furnace. My father's mesh floor. That dude, it, it sounded like somebody just threw a rock at me or hit the wall next to me. But was that you? Like, the furnace is shut off. The power shut off yeah, to it. That sounded like a rock was like. Oh, the power of the furnace is off. Yeah. It definitely sounded like something like chips or hit like, something. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what is going on? What? That was on the concrete. What was this? <laughs> I felt that you know how you know how somebody steps next to you and you can feel the thud through your body. Yeah. I felt that through my body, and it's weird because it's over here. That was over here where the stairs are. I've come an awful long way to talk to you. Are you guys down here? Ah! What's the matter? Something just hit the back of my leg. Are you guys down here? Ah! Janice thought a rock was thrown at the back of her leg. After carefully looking over the recordings, nothing hit the back of her leg. Nothing landed on the floor behind her. But right before the back of her leg was hit, we see something in the recording that is quite troubling. A skull face with deep dark eye sockets.
This looks to be the exact face that recently appeared on the steps upstairs. The stairs is directly above this portion of the basement. can't tell me that I was over-exaggerating about the women. I had even more dirty things to say, but I'm writing this at the wrong time. When I saw this last video, part of it made me think that it's an adult tape or something like it. Maybe it was the angle or the way the women was dressed and the quality overall. But unfortunately, it's a paranormal video where the wife is claiming that some activity is happening in her husband's house. It usually takes place in the bathroom. I guess this poor woman should know the truth. Their husband is likely to be masturbating in there. That would explain those sounds you're hearing, but this doesn't erase the reality of the door opening situation. There's never nothing in here. We've checked. This has happened several times. There's never been anything in here, but just in case, I'm going to go ahead and be careful about this. Safe, come in. Uh -oh. okay, so we set the camera up about 20 minutes ago and the knocking has resumed. So we're going to see if we can catch anything.
Okay, I'm gonna make sure. I'm gonna make sure this time. Oh, we've been recording so many times, waiting for this moment. Mm -hmm. No one in here. Look at you can see me, camera and camera. No one in here. Just to make sure you can see me coming in and checking. No. Uh, I had to use my tripod. I usually hold the camera with the tripod, but I use it for the phone. Look at that. Boom. Camera and camera. Nothing. Oh, that's awesome. Hold on. I have an idea. Go in, go in there real quick. Can you close the door? Can you hear me? No, no, not you. Oh. What? You see that? Do, can you do that again? Can you move the door again? <laughs> oh, damn. Oh my God, look at, holy. You seen this? Look at camera and camera, folks. When you see the first clip, you would immediately go with the thought of it being staged. But I guess the second part make it more confusing. So was that necessary for me to say? Absolutely not. I just didn't know what to add. So I think I deserve a subscribe for trying.